This is Chris Jenkins for CharlotteVibe.com. And just one day after allowing the Chicago Bulls to score 123 points, who, by the way, is the NBA's lowest scoring team, the Charlotte Hornets were able to come back to Charlotte and beat the Los Angeles Clippers and win a game. They snapped their six-game losing streak. The final score in this game was Charlotte Hornets 102, Los Angeles Clippers 87. And as always, after the game, we go into the locker room, I'm sorry, into the coach's room, and Coach Clifford said that this team, the reason for the victory tonight, they just play more solid. They play with more purpose. And I like that, but the scary thing is he doesn't seem to really know why that they played good. And I think that's the key that he has to figure out why if this team's going to turn this thing around and make a playoff run that not only makes it to the playoffs, but is able to win a series. So I also have a few key injury notes from this game. Jeremy Lamb was injured in this game. He left the game with a right hamstring strain. Coach Clifford says he believes it's something minor, but they won't know until Monday to have more information on that. Also, Kimball Walker got a little nixed up. He had a wrist sprain, but he was able to return and finish the game strong. So I'm going to wrap this one up with a few stats. Kimball Walker, though he was the leading scorer with 26 points, the voted on player of the game was Dwight Howard. Dwight Howard had 16 points and 16 rebounds. I need to go back and look at the stats, but it seems like whenever Dwight Howard is getting more than 15 rebounds, that's good news for the team and also something to note if you were here at the arena tonight, Dwight Howard made two consecutive free throws to close out the game. So that's great news, right? So next up for the Charlotte Hornets are the Minnesota Timberwolves. That'll be here in Charlotte at Monday. Continue to follow me on Twitter. If there's anything I didn't answer that you guys have a question about, I always love to hear, you, hear from you. So leave your comments below. Hit me up on Twitter. Thanks for watching.